What's up guys, Friday afternoon, I'm in the shed, I'm loading up, I'm gonna take the opportunity today to run you through one product that is fitted to every single vehicle in the convoy of Patriot Games. Now obviously we head out to the most remote locations around the world, places where you cannot stop and quickly grab diesel or pick up fuel. You might be a thousand kilometers in between service stations and that's a long range fuel tank from Brown Davis. Brown Davis are an Australian uh, company. They've been manufacturing tanks here in Australia forever and a day, but I'm gonna run you through the construction methods that Brown Davis use. And coming from a sheet metal background, uh, this is one of the products that we fit that we really get, we really understand. We've been involved with a lot of the development uh, with Brown Davis on most of the new model cars that you see uh, on Patriot Games. My engineering team works in uh, pretty well with the guys down at Brown Davis and helps those guys uh, really develop all these products from a uh, fitment and usage point of view and then they uh, deliver them, manufacture them, put them into the market for you guys to fit into your touring vehicles. Now when it comes to the construction, there are two millimetre uh, aluminised steel. The aluminised steel um, is a great product. It's a surface coating uh, on top of the steel for holding fuel and for holding diesel so you don't get corrosion inside the tank. They finish it off um, with this black paint, big black box they call it, that sits underneath uh, the truck, again, to stop that corrosion. Inside all of the tanks, it's what's inside that you don't see that really makes up the difference between a good and a bad long range tank. They're baffled inside and what those baffles are there to do is to give some rigidity to the construction of the tank, uh, but more predominantly it's to stop that fuel from sloshing around inside the tank. Now the Brown Davis range of tanks, they can go anywhere from about 85 litre replacement tanks up to about, I think the biggest tank that we have fitted is about 185 litres, but check with the guys there on your application for your vehicle. They've also got uh, swirl pots built in around the fuel pickup area, which is gonna stop uh, the fuel pump from running your engine dry when you're on some silly angles. And when it comes to angles, uh, they really take into account with Brown Davis that it's sitting underneath the vehicle, uh, the tapering, the shape of the tank to give you the best departure angles and ensure that uh, you're not gonna get them hung up. Obviously breathers, all the standard stuff. Some tanks come with transfer pumps. Some tanks come with uh, replacement OE fuel pickups so it doesn't affect your fuel gauges or whatever. But again, check with the guys at Brown Davis on the application that would suit your touring vehicle. This is one of the must have products when you're building a touring truck. Trust me, I'm really good at running out of fuel even when I have one of these. And typically speaking, it's not the tank's fault. It's normally driver error for not keeping an eye um, on my gauges. So that's about it. I'm gonna finish loading up the D-Max. We're heading out on the trip this weekend and I am out of here.